guys' uh, usual embargo, um, which is 10 30 this evening. If I could see a show of hands for the mics, and if you could give your name and organisation for your question, I'd be grateful. Good afternoon, Pep. The club confirmed yesterday the severity of Leroy Sane's injury that he has hurt his ACL. Can you give us a time scale? Do you know when you expect to have him back? No, I don't know. I'm not a doctor, I'm physio, so normally there are this kind of injury ACL, so it's, I don't know, six months. Uh, hopefully in February, March, can be come back with us. Given the fact there was a lot of speculation about his future you were potentially planning for him to leave this summer do you have a plan to cope without him i didn't potentially think about if he was leaving always i said the same as our player the player didn't tell me i want to leave so always i thought he was our player for the reason play all the precision in the start 11 in the final he, he played so unfortunately it's uh, incredible bad news because in three seasons we had three ACLs, so uh, he's a young player and uh, and hopefully, uh, you know, recover well. I think he's in the best hands as possible in the terms of the cirurgy next next week. And uh, and all the people here are going to try to help him to be comfortable in the tough moments because after one month, two months, he will feel alone and try to, to be with him as much as possible and and recover as well as possible. So do you have a plan? Have you come up with a plan since you got the news to cope without him for the next few months? Without him? Yeah, we don't have another alternative. So the fact he's not here, like in the first season, we didn't have we didn't have uh, Gundogan in the second season with uh, Benjamin. Like we play with Fabian Delph and after with Alex when both are not left backs. And um, and they did it incredibly well, Fabian and, and Alex. And, and now Leroy. Uh, it just... Let, let him feel we are here and we are going to wait him. Bernardo Silva told me on Wednesday that the players had voted for the captain. That vote took place on Wednesday. Can you tell us who they picked and who's going to be yeah, in the David team? David Silva is our, will be our captain and uh, Fernandinho, Kevin and Sergio. And what attributes does David Silva have to lead this team? Well, captain has to be what, uh, what uh, he is. So David is a... Uh, Almost one decade here, he knows the club, because the Premier League. It's incredible, res been respect for, for his mates. And, um, and nothing. The decision have to take when they think what is the best for the team, for the club. Everything is going well. Pet Mandy from the Premier League. Um, Gundogan has been quite honest in saying that, that he was considering a move away to get the final contract of his career. So what do you think persuaded him to stay at Manchester City? No, I didn't... In my point of, of, of view, or what in these kind of situations, uh, I said we won't. I spoke, I think, once with him. I said I would be so delighted if you can stay because uh, you are an and a player that is so difficult to find in Europe. Of in terms of personality, and plays in different positions. that always play in a high level. And uh, all I can say is thank you to him and the club for the effort, you know, for the be consistent and insistent to, to keep him, to keep him uh, with us for the next four years. And how impressed have you been with the progress that Manuel Pellegrini seems to be making at West Ham? Well, I think last season finished quite well. So at the end, Manuel has the, 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 I think the biggest quality you can incredible in the first moment, identify the way, the way he plays. And uh, the, st the beginning of start of the season was not easy. In the fact that we, he lost the first three or four games in a row, that when your star arrives and lost out of games is not. But I know he's a, a calm person, and I think the West Ham board support him. And and the end of the season, he made a good result, winning in, in, in again Tottenham away in, in in good in good games, Watford, and so and always so the quality of the he plays his teams and especially the quality of the players up front they have with Lanzini with a, with a many 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 good players in front you know uh, it's it's the first game always the first game it's always okay what's going to happen so I would prefer to play at home we play away is always uh, tricky 
But uh, I think we are ready. We are ready. We trained really good this, this week. And when you've won back-to-back titles in, in the way that you've won them, just how hard is it to make improvements to your side? I said many times this question. Always we can improve. Myself the first and the team as well. Individually, collectively, always we can improve. Always. Pep, the four times you've gone to the London Stadium, you've, you've won them all by a combined score of 17-1. Seems to be one of your easier games. Why is that? It's the past. It was past, were good games. Uh, we were better in, in some periods. The, the last one against Pellegrini, we won 19-0-3, but it was a fake fake uh, result because they had chances. We, we, we didn't create too many. We were so clinical up front, but the, our game was not really good. But it's the past, so it's, it's the first game of the season always is... Of course, we play an important game in the Community Shield, like we won one title. We have already won, but it's the fact that the first one start. But I saw the team, I saw the team quite well this week, training all of them incredible good. Have you decided yet whether Rodri and Cancelo are going to start their pre- first Premier League games, and do you have to give a thought to whether no, they Cancelo need to is adapt? not going to play, not yet. Uh, arrived two days ago, but he's going to settle good. Uh, had experience, especially when you play in Juventus, the Turin, important team. You are used to them in terms of mentality and the way they play, you know, to win, win, win. And uh, and Rodri, every day I'm more convinced that uh, what we have done, this deal with him, will be one of the best this club has done in the in the last years. So will be an incredible holding midfielder for us, for this club, for English football, uh, for many years. Pep Don McGuinness, Talk Sport. In terms of uh, Cancelo coming in, what, were you, what was your thinking with, obviously, Kyle Walker has done very well in that position. You obviously want competition, but uh, what kind of a player is he in terms of, in comparison to Walker? Well, I said many times, uh, especially to him, so he came and uh, he gave us something we didn't have. And honestly, uh, without him, it would have been so difficult to achieve. So his physicality is... is beyond of normal, but we need competition, they need competition. I think for Kyle it's important to have a good good competition, what he had with uh, with, Danilo, with Danny, and with Cancelo it's going to happen again. So uh, both have to fight for for same position, and Cancelo can play in the left as well, because in Turin play in left side too. So, so but it's good, it's good for, for the team. So the guy who is better fit and more confident, more chances to play. But in that moment, Kyle knows everything about the way we want to play, and and of course, right now, Kyle is it's 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 the first one. And just a word about David Silva being the captain. You mentioned that obviously he has clearly respect of his teammates. But when you've had Vincent Company being the captain for so long, what kind of captain do you feel David will be? He's obviously different, but he what, has what to qualities? be he, he has to be himself. So. David has to be himself. He's going to think what is the best when take decisions for the team, and will not be a problem. So normally, when depends of the captains, is easy easy life when uh, when the locker room is, are nice nice guys. They will have it. So they know each other. They they love a lot. They have fun a lot when they are together. So I think it's not will not be a problem. When the problem they are, I am the club are there. So. So, no problems. So, we'll be a, a good captain. Hi, Pep. Andy Hampson from PA. You mentioned at Wembley the situation with Riyad Mahrez and the, the medication. Has, has that been resolved now? Is he, yeah. Is he, he's clear to play, is he? Yeah. Okay. And is um, Laporte back with you this yeah. week? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Any more for the embargo? This is my idol. I love you. Okay. Uh, 10, 15, 15, 15, 15.